Hello everybody and good morning. It is currently Monday. I love starting a Monday with a good workout. It's actually sunny and I haven't seen the sun in like 15 days here. Fair enough, there was some sunny days and I was inside working or in back-to-back -back meetings and so I told myself I'm just gonna start today with a little beautiful walk by the beach. I'm running out the door soon, but I thought I'd show you my little outfit of the day. So this is what it looks like. The coats from uh, Louis Vuitton shirt will be Ralph Lauren. Bag is my Hermes Birkin 30. And then I'm wearing a little um, navy cashmere sweater and my jewelry is my usual one. Same for the watch, etc. Oh, and the booties are Aide which are those right there. Absolutely love this one. So I'm also wearing a Chanel belt, but you cannot see that. Although if you watch me on TikTok, by the way, I'll leave it linked either down below or um, on the side on the screen, you will be able to see the belt I'm wearing today because I'm basically getting ready there these days. Hello, everybody. It is currently midday. I am just going to make myself some lunch. Uh, just got back from doing a little bit of shopping. I went to a mess. I bought some stuff for my husband. I'll be unboxing it um, later on this box with you. I also got a couple of goodies for myself to get me ready for the trip. And yeah, I will show you that in just about a minute. I just finished my lunch and I thought I'd share with you um, some of the things. What I've realized is that I cannot show you what I purchased for him because obviously I want him to be the one unboxing it. So I basically got him... Should I tell you what I got him? Maybe I'll ask if it's okay for him to be on my vlogs and if he wants to be on the unboxing video. If not, I'll just share some pictures if there's any male um, people watching. But I'm pretty sure you could guess from the box. Let me know what you thought it was on the comments down below. Now for myself, I actually just unboxed this on Instagram and TikTok. Um, so I don't have the ribbon there, but it's literally um fresh still from the store this one right here is something that i wanted for this particular trip and it's a color combination i've been waiting for them to have since forever now i'm a big fan for this time of the year of any gavroche pieces i think they're so easy to style the design on this one is beautiful. It's obviously 100% silk. It's got the twill silk, which is um, something I really, really appreciate because it's a um, material that's gonna be thermoregulator. So you're able to wear it as much in summer as you are in winter. In summer, it's gonna keep you fresh and in winter, it's gonna keep you warm. So silk is one of those like magic fabrics. The reason I was particularly attracted to this one was the gold shade how Hermes calls it in there which is basically like that toasted camel which I'm very very much into I thought it would be a perfect complement for my Birkin now if you are able to see that it says a mess and it kind of has a rock and roll vibe to it without going into like a full-on la 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 which I'm so into honestly I'm obsessed with this one it was my essay who suggested it and I was like yes like don't even show me other ones we still did go through the other ones because it's always fun to look but um i did end up going for the first one which was this one she really knows my colors the way i like to wear this one is where the label is i'll just flip that downwards like so like a little bit so i get a long end in here and then i'm gonna tie that behind and i'll wear them inside like that i find that when you just want a little bit of that extra warmth or a little bit of light in your face um they're perfect without adding too much bulk like a big scarf would i feel like big scarves are pieces that are more meant to be worn as like the staple piece on itself if, for example if i wasn't wearing this shirt underneath and i just had 
this sweater, um, probably I'd have to brighten up my face a little bit. So something like this would come in really, really handy. I think this piece will be beautiful for my upcoming trip. I think it's gonna marry really well with the outfits for when we're staying at the countryside and it's gonna marry really well for the outfits when we're at the beach side as well. Now, this is something I didn't purchase. It was actually a gift from my essay and I am obsessed with it. It is the number seven carte noire, which is basically like not in cards. It gives you different ideas on how to tie and accessorize your scarves. Like how cute is this, for example? I don't know if I'd do it, but I love the idea of it. So it gives you an idea on how to grab your Kelly and put a scarf around it. And then it shows you on the other side what it's going to look like, which I think is just brilliant. And as a stylist, I think this is a beautiful gift, honestly. And now the final piece. <gasps> Something I've been waiting for them to do for so long. I am so, so excited about this piece. I think it's going to marry so well with the rest of the pieces in my wardrobe. It is such a gorgeous, gorgeous one. If you haven't seen on Instagram or TikTok already, let me know what you think it is on the comments. Now, this is a lovely pair of Oran sandals, but this is a limited edition one. Have you guessed already? It is the navy base in leather, and then this is the um, dark navy denim. I think they're just beautiful, honestly. I had been on the lookout for a pair of sandals in this color. I find this model super, super comfortable, and it's not easy for me to find sandals that are comfortable. Um, you might have seen I tend to hide my feet on pictures or stuff like that because I had two surgeries on my feet when I was younger and they're like completely deformed and then <laughs> one of my um, pinky toes got broke and etc etc so feet are a mess but it's like a structural mess I cannot um, make that prettier maybe I could get some surgery I don't know anyway I think the color is absolutely gorgeous let me show you the other one I mean, it's basically the same, but yeah, this is what they look like and I am so happy with them. I wear them on a 38 and a half, even if regularly on most brands, I'll be a 38. But for Hermes Orans and for Chanel Slingbacks, also for Chanel Valerinas, I tend to size half a size up. I could still fit them on the 39, the Orans, but I feel like it stylizes my feet a little bit more on the 38 and a half, and my foot doesn't come out on the end. Like it's still a good sizing for me. So that's everything I got at Hermes on this occasion. If you are interested in knowing how they wear out or anything like that, don't ever hesitate to leave a comment down below or send me a DM. I am always available for a chat on Instagram and I love connecting with you guys in there as well. Welcome to Hats Heaven. Oh my goodness. I love this place. It's literally Hats Heaven. And today I'm gonna take you downstairs to the atelier so let's go ahead and go where nobody gets to go basically This is a little work in progress, absolutely stunning. And right here we have the bridal collection. How gorgeous is this? Oh my goodness. If I'm ever to renew my vows, like this is the vibe. Là, tu vas me dire ce que tu penses parce que en fait, je trouve que le peigne Okay, no, I changed my mind. This is what I'll get married in. Remarried. I need a marri I need a wedding by year now. <laughs> this is stunning. Oh my 
Let's look at the detailing. In. Hello, my darlings. A quick little outfit check before I check out. I'm about to catch a little transatlantic flight, um, but before I'm making a stop in Paris for some meetings, a final live, and then we're heading to South America. I have my usual jewelry, Celine Sunnies, which I really love. I'm also wearing an Hermes blazer. I have a baby cashmere veil sweater and I have another layer of cashmere underneath. This is one of those intimissimi pieces, which I find really, really useful for the plane because I get quite cold in planes. Then I'm wearing a pair of Arcade jeans, Nike shoes. And then I have this gorgeous bag, which actually was a gift from a client. So it's in leather. It's um, lovely sort of forest green leather with real bamboo handles. And I find that so pretty. Also, it's really useful because it's got like um, a little shoulder strap as well.